Hello everybody, I hope you are all well. Welcome to Bassmaster Fishing. Now, today, a short video. First off, I'm going to show you a location I was fishing previously down on the Sabrine River. And what a honey spot it was! There was loads of fish spawning in this area. Now, I'm just trying to pick off the location. It was somewhere down here where it goes off to the left. If my memory serves me correctly. Ah, yes. Approximately straight in front where that tree is. This one here, I think. Approximately in this area. And I say approximately because if you come here, you may have to cast around just a little bit to find the fish. But... This is the general area I was fishing in, round about here. Okay, so I'm going to show you the best two catches that I got out of this spot. I caught loads of fish. Now, you can see loads of fish down there. I was catching one after the other after the other. But the difficult part was catching, you know, the good fish. Blue catfish, I was catching loads of them. And this was the best blue catfish I had out of this session when I was last here. Now, when people show you these hot spots, what I'm going to tell you, maybe what other people don't tell you, possibly, is I was in this location for over two hours before I got these two fish. I think the more time you put in, the better chance chances are you're going to catch the better fish. Or you could just get lucky. I have been lucky in the past. I've gone to certain locations. Boom. I've caught a good fish straight away. Other times, like this session, I was on this lake approximately two hours in this spot before I caught this 81 pound blue catfish and the following clip I'm going to show you is a legendary catch it was a bass called the legend and these were the two best fish I had out of this honey spot here I had loads of bass loads of trophies lots of small stuff I had a 28 pound gar it was literally cast and catch here. But the difficult part was putting a lure on that was going to catch um, a legendary fish. And you'll see what happens in the following clip regarding that. And what, and what I actually put on um, regarding um, baits and lures to catch that legendary fish. Out of all them fish down there. So here we go. We've got him in and look at this. And at the moment, this is my biggest blue fish, uh, blue fish, no, blue catfish, should I say, um, out of the Sabrine River at the moment. I've caught loads of 70s all the time. I'm catching 70s, and that was the first um, blue catfish that I had at 81 pounds. So I was quite happy with that. And check the bass points out. Loads of bass points. Okay. Let me just say, it is raining. This is the same session. I had it set up. Look at all the fish down there. Did you see them? Um, I had it set on dynamic weather. And when I started on this lake, it was at 7 a.m. in the morning. Dynamic weather. That, that was the setting I had it on. But I was on this lake approximately two hours. And I had to put this top water lure on. The jigabug. Shakalaka. Giant bass. Boom shakalaka. Apparently that's a giant bass. It's a legend anyway. Um, but yeah. Here are the setups. That's what I was catching catfish on. I had a couple of flatheads as well. And to catch that uh, legendary bass, the one you've just seen, I had to put the jitterbug on top water law 
The reason I say I had to put that jitterbug on was I was trying all the other lures and um, I didn't get a legendary until I put that jitterbug on and boom, I got the legendary. So, yeah, that's all folks. Just a short video. Enjoy your day and stay safe.